Hi everybody, this is Kyle Sears from Zoll Medical. Today's Zoll X-Series Tips and Tricks video is going to focus on the management of data coming out of the Zoll X-Series. So we're going to take a look at how to get the information from the cardiac monitor into Zoll's QA software platform, Zoll Case Review, a byproduct of which will allow you to integrate into any of the major EPCR vendors as well, so that your report is filled out not only accurately, but in a more timely fashion. So let's take a look. The first thing we're going to take a look at is the process in which we move the data from the X-Series. Bottom left corner, the white arrow that loops back, you're going to go ahead and press that. That'll bring you into the second page of options. The fourth button down says log. This is essentially the memory of the machine. So whether you're going in here to print out a code summary, trending reports of the vitals during the call. You also have the ability to go into this white envelope. So when we're moving this data electronically, we want to hit the white envelope. The screen will come up and say, do you want to close case or continue? Depending on when you're doing this will dictate your choice. So if it's at the end of the case, you're basically done treating the patient. You say, all right, I want to manually close this patient file. You can go ahead and hit close case. If this is 10 minutes after the call, you can go in to continue and you'll see a list of the calls that have previously been closed. They're all identified by date, time, and duration, so they're easy to figure out. The steps are hitting enter. That'll drop you down into the list of calls. Select which call that you'd like. You can select a maximum of 15 calls. You then hit the home button and transfer will be lit up. So the next step is gonna to be to transfer this data. Now this is contingent in you, on you having some sort of connectivity to the internet. So whether that be Wi-Fi or a cellular connection, you just wanna make sure that you have some sort of available uh, internet connectivity. So in this case, I'm gonna hit transfer. I'll see a progress bar come up here. What determines the length of this process is how data rich the call is. So if you have a really intense cardiac arrest call, there's going to be more information, more data uh, to compile and transfer. But you'll see, it'll say transferring current case, and you'll have a percentage complete right here. Once we get the message that says disclosure log transfer complete, then information in that case file have now been sent up to Zoll Online. And within Zoll Online, you have your case review account. Case review acts as the conduit for the information to be passed to any of the EPCR platforms that you may be using as well. So that'll be the next thing we take a look at. When using ESO as your EPCR platform, Open a new EHR report and select Vital Signs across the top. Select the green tab labeled Monitor Import and then select Zoll Cloud. ESO is configured to query your Zoll case review account every two minutes. When it sees a new case file available, it will display it here and allow you to associate the call that you would like with the EHR report that you're working on. Select the call and press import. The import done message will appear on the screen and you can select OK. Now all of the data that was uploaded from the Zoll X series becomes part of your EHR report. You'll now see all of the interventions that were uploaded from the X series, including any electrical interventions, code markers, 12 leads, vitals, and other information that was uploaded from the monitor. This completes the upload process and allows you to look at any of the interventions in more detail or complete the rest of your report and you're all done.